okay now we are in friction chapter friction now i am going to derive the expression for minimum force that is effort required to move a body which is on different types of plane that is horizontal plane or inclined plane let us move to the first case that is a body rests on a horizontal plane horizontal plane which is in at rest what is the minimum force or effort required to move this body in this direction let us resolve this the body weight is in downward direction when the body moves in this direction automatically frictional force f is in the opposite direction and normal reaction is perpendicular to the plane horizontal plane so now we can resolve this this like that is normal force this is the frictional force this is the weight sigma v resolve this forces vertically that is normal reaction n is equal to w and resolve this forces horizontally so p is equal to f here f is the frictional force as you know that frictional force is equal to mu into n that is mu to n where n is equal to w that is the when a body rests on a horizontal plane the minimum force or effort required to move this body in this direction is mu w now we are moving to the second case that is the board a body rests on a plane plane uh, horizontal plane if the effort is applied with a, an angle theta with the horizontal plane here you can a body in this direction a body weight in this downward direction a normal force in upward direction and frictional force is also opposite to the body motion that is frictional force now we resolve this equation that is this one resolve this forces and this is n this is p with it makes angle theta with the horizontal plane this is the frictional force now we resolve this forces vertically that is okay now we resolving the forces vertically sigma v is equal to 0 and p sin theta plus n minus w is equal to 0 that is p sin theta plus n minus w is equal to 0 you can write this as n is equal to w minus p sin theta so resolve the forces horizontally p cos theta minus f is equal to 0 that is p cos theta is equal to f where f is the frictional force that is the mu n here you can submit the n value that is mu into n where n this is the one you can replace n as w minus p sin theta 
here mu w plus mu sin theta mu p sin theta <coughs> okay no now we can move this mu p sin theta to this side it is p cos theta plus mu p sin theta equal to mu w with the p is comma cos theta plus mu sin theta is equal to mu w then p is equal to mu w by cos theta plus mu sin theta here mu is equal to tan phi that the coefficient of friction is equal to tan phi you can replace mu as a tan phi tan phi w by cos theta plus tan phi sin theta you can write the tan phi as a sin phi w by and cos phi into cos theta this is the cos theta plus tan phi as a sin phi by cos phi sin theta now multiplying this cos theta into the this in, in, with these terms then it occurs as a sin phi by cos theta cos phi cos phi cos theta plus here cos phi and cos phi is crossed then only sin phi sin theta thus the trigonometric function that is cos phi cos theta plus sin phi sin theta is equal to cos theta minus phi this is the minimum force required when the body at rest and the force is applied with an angle theta with the horizontal 